And thank you. Well, if you don't have tickets to shares a tour stop in Cincinnati on April 7th, you can at least get an up close look at some of her most glamorous costumes at Covington's Barringer Crawford Museum. The museum's newest exhibit is from Rituals to Runways, the art of the bead. And it covers a lot more than just costumes and here to talk all about it are the museum's executive director, Lori Risch and Jason French, who is the curator of collections there. Thank you both for joining us today. Thanks for well, having thank you. us. You have brought a lot of cool stuff with you as you always do. Tell us about the art of the bead. What are people going to find there? Oh my gosh, it goes <laughs> anywhere from beads that are 3,000 years old all the way up to, like you say, the share costumes. So we have uh, samples here of some wearable beaded art. Um, this was done by Bob Haven out of Lexington, all done but with tambour beading style, ah. which is the high fashion uh, beading system of, of being able to do it. So he worked with the Miss Kentucky pageant. Okay. And so that's what the tiaras are. Very cool. Um, this is a beautiful, elegant jacket that's all done again in the tambour bead style. Wow. And then it goes into the African as well. And uh, talk about some of the, the pieces that you all were able to, uh, to gather for this exhibit. So uh, through just really good fortune and, and talking to the right people, we, we have collectors that are local and, and uh, from a little further away that have allowed us to borrow beads really from all over the world, from almost every continent in the world wow. we have examples of beads from. We have a tremendous uh, room of African beads, and we've brought a couple of things here I today that are um, they were made. These are these massive beads here are from Morocco, but the beads closer to you are actually recycled oh, uh, yeah, these are vinyl cool. records. So that's amazing. Look at that, and they are just amazing beads. Um, but we've been very fortunate in in the scope and the depth of what we've been able to display. In this exhibit, uh, so it's and all local, pretty much from local collectors. Yes, That's it's pretty it's cool. pretty well regional. So wow. from Columbus to Lexington to Cincinnati. Um, How did someone get a hold of Cher's collection. costumes? Well, is that a story um, you can share? Maybe not. <laughs> well, just um, very interested in, in wow. her and her clothing, and bought them at auctions. Pretty fascinating. And, um, but they're fantastic, and okay. they're they're all from the '70s, all right. from the Sunny and Cher show. All right, very cool. So, give us information on where and when people can see it, and uh, where they can call to get information. Go bcmuseum.org. It'll give you everything. We have a bead bash with our opening celebration next Friday from uh, six to eight workshops that you can learn how to do this and karaoke and costume share costume sunny and share costume contest coming up as well oh very so all cool. kinds of fun things happening. oh that's awesome all right guys thank you so much for joining us we really appreciate it